It's not a shocker that adults and children today are getting less sleep than they did before. In fact, 35% of adults get less than seven hours of sleep per night, and 23% of adults are chronic insomniacs. And the question is, what does that do to your metabolic health? And the answer is, it does two things, both bad. The first is, it's a stress. It raises your cortisol. And we've already talked about cortisol being a mitochondrial dissociator. It basically creates heat instead of creating ATP. That's bad for your metabolic health because now your cells are basically running on empty. No wonder you feel lousy. Second, sleep deprivation increases a hormone that is responsible for hunger, which comes from the stomach, called ghrelin. Ghrelin is released in response to sleep deprivation, circulates in the bloodstream, goes to your brain and says, I'm hungry, feed me. And so you end up eating more, which will only raise your glucose excursions and your insulin response and generate increased fat and, of course, chronic metabolic disease. So chronic sleep deprivation affects cortisol driving metabolic dysfunction and ghrelin driving increased eating. Everyone thinks that, oh, I'm eating more because I'm up longer. No, you're eating more because your ghrelin is dysfunctional. So how do you fix sleep deprivation? Well, one way is cut the caffeine because caffeine is exactly what's wrong with sleep. But that's not the only thing. The other thing to do is take the screens out of your bedroom. Studies show that children who sleep with their phones charging in their bedroom get 28 minutes less sleep per night than children whose screens are charging outside their bedroom. The blue light by itself alters the uh, diurnal rhythms of the brain ultimately leading to metabolic dysfunction. So sleep deprivation, stress reduction, all part and parcel of the same metabolic toxic mix. So does sleep affect your CGM? And the answer is, at levels we've shown that the more sleep people get, the more time in range, and the lower the glucose excursions that we see. More sleep, more better from a glucose standpoint.